skinny my <gasps> Fiona Fail! Oh, that's oh man, yeah, my I don't know about this stuff. It's all up in my eye. Hey guys, so today's video is going to be one that I really have never done on my channel and not really done anything like this. It's going to be beauty hacks and trends. So I have a couple trends or like challenges slash what people have been doing. And I also have a lot of weird hacks that supposedly work, but we're gonna be testing them out. But you might notice that I'm in a completely different space, but I have a reason for that. I have a really special guest on my channel today. Hi guys, I'm Fiona. I have my own channel, Fiona Frills, and welcome to my blue room. So I want my makeup routine to be much easier, so we're gonna be testing these out and seeing if they work. So yes, I have this special, wonderful little person. No. So I have Fiona Frills on my channel today. We also did a video on her channel. We did like testing out this weird face mask, but I'm not mm -hmm. going to tell you too much. You're going to have to check it out for yourself. The link will be in the description. Solo her channel, so you should totally go check her out. And if you're from my channel, subscribe. Aww, if you don't, okay. like, I'm going to like go push you to like subscribe. Yes. Okay. And so basically, she's going to be helping me test out these weird trends slash hacks. Mm -hmm. That's why we have no makeup on. Yes. We're both really big makeup gurus. Oh yeah. I mean, who doesn't love makeup here? I know. It's like an art. It's so fun. We wanted to see if these hacks make our days easier. Yes. So we have a bunch of weird stuff, so we're just gonna go ahead and get started. Woo! So Fiona actually doesn't really know what these hacks are. She does know some of them, but not really in depth. We're gonna start off with trends, and we're gonna start with our eyebrows. Oh my gosh, is that the squiggle brows? <laughs> this is the squiggly brow. So here's a picture of what the squiggly brow looks like. It's really weird. So we're gonna try and attempt to do it. Okay, so she's looking at the photo right now. So I have glue sticks, so I'm gonna open these up and use those. These are glue sticks, they are non-toxic. So now what you're gonna do is you're gonna just run it through your brows. Okay. I got the glue on, it feels like really sticky. Yeah. So now she's just gonna like kind of carve out her brows basically. I'm using the Luminaire Concealer. It's kind of like the Tarte Shape Tape, but a little more like creamy. Oh my gosh, this feels odd. It so that's what it looks like. It's really hard to it do. It doesn't really look real. Okay, so next what we're gonna be doing is one with eyeliner. And you're supposed to like be able to do your liner and curling your lashes at the same time. Yeah. I'm a little confused. Yeah, so you guys are gonna wanna put it like right on the top. So you need a really, really gel eyeliner. I got mine on. I don't think this is gonna work. It just went on my eyelash. I think so. I don't no, know. No. It does not work. So this one's really weird. I'm gonna read it to you and you're gonna, I'm gonna see your reaction. Make your eyelashes extra long with the help of a cotton ball. Wait. After applying your usual one coat of mascara, take lash slash brow brush and rub it into a cotton ball. This will transfer some of the cotton fibers onto the brush. Wipe the brush onto your lashes, apply another coat of mascara and repeat many times as you want. You'll get major lashes in no time. So it's like fibers. Cool. Okay, so apply your regular mascara. Okay. Do your groove. Here's a cotton ball. Keep going. It's seriously just taking it off. It's like the cotton ball is like taking all the mascara off. I have two in my eye right now. I don't know about this. Oh my goodness. It's kind of working, but I feel like it's also kind of just removing it. So I'm gonna apply another coat of mascara. Yeah, no. I, this isn't, no. These beauty hacks kind of suck. Okay, okay, Molly, me too. So this next one is really weird. It involves a spoon and an eyeliner. So you're gonna start by taking the, this part of the spoon and lining it up where you want it. Yeah, this is really weird. Okay, so you're gonna make a line, and then you this take the spoon, like this and part, and you line it up to like the your line, and then you like fill it in. Oh my gosh! It kind of does work, honestly. Guys, do you guys see that? What I made with the spoon? Oh my gosh, that actually works. So basically, <laughs> you take like a really long lasting liquid lipstick and you're able to take it off with olive oil. I think it's, I know it's gonna work. I am almost really? positive. I'm gonna be taking an O for liquid lipstick. Okay, so the one I'm gonna be taking is the Maybelline. Superstay Matte Ink in the color Heroin. This one is super long lasting. Oh my gosh. Well, we'll see if that works. Ooh. Just take it off like I need <gasps> Okay guys, so I'm gonna try this now. I look a little crazy. I know. I thought it was gonna work. Oh yeah. my gosh. That's so weird. Mine isn't working. 
Wow. If you have a really long lasting lipstick, this is gonna like yes. crave your mood. Weird, I feel like it's like hit or miss. So like uh -huh. some liquid lipstick, yeah, nah. Yeah. So next we're gonna be trying one that's really weird. Basically what this is supposed to do is you put it under your foundation. That way it makes you look very soft and like a really natural look. So we're gonna put that theory to the test. And if you're one of my old subscribers, you know I never wear foundation. So this is a little different. If you do wear a foundation, props to you. So I'm gonna take my California. Just gonna apply it. This is so weird. Okay, I look a little crazy, but now. So this is the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Foundation. So I'm just gonna take my beauty sponge. Yeah, I feel like it's an extra step, and I don't think it's really showing up on my skin. I think it kind of works. You would have to apply a lot of blush on for it to really come through. I don't know. I just think it's an extra step that you don't really need to take. I mean, if you really like that natural look, then... Okay, so this one, we both pulled our hair back. So this one is supposed to replace a beauty blender with a hard-boiled leg. You're basically going to blend out your foundation, your concealer, your cream stuff with this. So... It's hard to like bounce. What the heck? You don't need very much because it's like a hard boiled egg, so it won't like absorb anything. Can't no. really like blend. Oh, this looks so perfect. It looks amazing. Just like flawless. Like this doesn't even work. This does not work. No. Baby chinchilla. Okay, guys, welcome to the end of this video. So if you guys watched to this point in the video, comment down below hard boiled egg. Yes. <laughs> So guys, that was it. Make sure to go over to Fiona's channel and subscribe because she's amazing. <laughs> that was it. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you're new, subscribe and become part of the hashtag hive. Uh, I changed it, guys, to the hashtag hive because it's like a little bubbly hive. <laughs> Love you guys so, so much. Stay with me. And don't forget, never, never stop buzzing, buzzing your own buzz. buzz. I'll see you guys next time. Love you so, so much. Bye. -bye.